Good morning, ladies, and happy, happy, happy Thursday. Thursday, January 15th, 2015. Uh, hopefully you're having a good day. It looks like it's actually going to rain. I'm trying to get myself together for the morning. I'm actually heading out. The chit chat portion of this video is going to actually happen in the evening, but I definitely want to come out and do my live OPK. It's about 8, 10 a.m. now. And the funny thing about these videos is that you get me in all my lovely morning glory. Unfortunately, I'm not like Beyonce. I don't wake up, you know, like just flawless. <laughs> Um, but I hope that tickles you. So let's see what's happening with the OPKs. So it's blinking and the wand foe is still moving across the way. And I am cycle day 11 today. Cycle day 11. I was just saying yesterday, no, nope, I don't think that's gonna happen. No, I'm not gonna pick on cycle day 12. No, it's way too light. And what do you think happens? Cycle day 11. Ah, pink. And a very dark wand full. So this shall be entertaining. <laughs> and so I am dressed and ready to go. As you can see, I am at peak on cycle day 11. The funny thing is, last night I was um, in the bathroom and I was going through my little apps and looking. And the month that I got pregnant, I peaked on cycle day 11 and I was looking at it and I was going to delete it because I was like that can't that can't be right because usually it's several cycle day 12 or cycle day 14 so last night I was going to delete it and move it up to cycle day 12 because I was like ah that has to be wrong I guess not so we're gonna go with it <sighs> hey ladies good evening it is the same day January Thursday Thursday whatever date Thursday was in the beginning of this video I am home. I've actually been home for almost two hours. Uh, and when I got in, it was at least 12 hours since earlier was OPK. It is still the same. I meant to show it to you, but then I started talking to my mother and I was on the phone with her for like a half an hour. And so, you know, after about that time, you go back to look at it, it's already dried up. So you can't really... Anyway, it's still the same. I hope you had a very, very fun Thursday. I did. Um... <sighs> I can't believe that I had my peak on cycle day 11. Like, this is crazy. So I probably will ovulate tomorrow or either the 13th. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure out when I want to start taking my progesterone. So I'm probably going to start it on cycle day 14 just to be right and in the clear. I think I'm going to start on the morning of cycle day 14. I'm not really sure. Um... <sighs> but so far, so good today. I've been super, super busy. I'm usually home all day during the day, um, but I wasn't. I was out gallivanting and doing tons of different things. So that was interesting. Oh, I meant to ask you, how many of you use the clear blue digital OPKs with the smiley faces? If you use them, let me know what your opinion is of them. I've used them and they've always been very good to me, but I've read about a lot of different women who take them and then they like they get blinkies for like eight days and then it never shows their peak. So I'm interested in knowing um, what you use and if you don't use it, what do you use and it, do you really like that? Because I use the Wanfos. I happen to actually love Wanfos. I don't have a problem with reading them. I think they are some of the clearest I've ever used I, and I love the blinky. So I was thinking earlier, I just love like how you have a plan for something and then doesn't actually work out the way you want. And the last two cycles I've had, it hasn't worked out the way I want. The one I got pregnant and then this one now. Uh, because you know of course my plan was oh I'm gonna baby dance every day until my peak and then two days after that but I really was hoping for a cycle day 14 peak like I wasn't gonna get my style at smell it face until cycle day 14 uh, because then I felt like okay well if I get on cycle day 14 then it gives me a bunch of days to like baby dance way before time getting it on cycle day 11 it just shortened my time frame and it didn't actually work the way I wanted it to work um, but obviously there's a reason for everything and you know they say that about life like you have a plan for something and then it just doesn't work out the way you want it to work out but th th maybe there is some maybe there is some, some reason for it the only thing that keeps me positive about it is like I was telling you uh, last night literally last night I literally was going through my little bit of phone looking at my old cycles and stuff and I saw cycle day 11 on there as a peak day and I was like ah no 
that ain't right. And it's a good thing I didn't change it. I was going to change it just for my records because I was like, maybe I made a mistake and put that on there instead of... <sighs> But I did. Oh, while I'm sitting here, I guess I can show you a part of my hallway since I don't have anything else to really talk about today. So I guess I will share with you the top part here. Uh, when you walk into my house, this is what you see. It says home. You can see H-O-M-E. And then there's a mirror there. And then there's a B for my last name. Uh, and then right here where all the glare is, it says home is where your heart is. And this one says gather here with grateful hearts. And uh, this mirror here uh, says the brown thing because obviously our last name is brown. And then on the bottom it says the love of a family is life's greatest gift. I absolutely love this mirror. We got it from Personal Creations. It was quite the expensive mirror, but I love it. I, lo I just absolutely love it. Oh, and down below it is um, a little thing with, I don't, I'm, I'm at a loss for words right now. But y you know what that is. Let's see if I can focus it a little better. Yeah, that's better. Uh, and then it has a wedding picture. And then this was the album for my wedding. We did a personalized album. Let's see if I open it up since we all have been here, right? We, we all have been here. Let's just, let's just go through and look at everything. And so in here, it has a bunch of people, obviously, that came to our wedding and signed it. Um, but then on the other pages... That's pictures of us from our engagement photo shoot that we put all in there. And then a note to our guests from when they came to sign it. Like Bible verses and all sorts of things. This is the room for my wedding that I jumped. And um, this is us. And this is us. And these three things that you see here were all from Things Remember. We got quite a few things from Things Remember for our wedding. Uh, and then this here, let's, let's just give it a tour. This is the d door to the nursery. And all of these are pictures from our vow renewal last year. I love this. This is from Bath and Body, right? And then right beside it is something, oh, let me turn on the other light. Something that I actually plan to do a little bit of a tutorial on. Okay, here, don't mind my laundry baskets. This is a board and it has all of the cards from our wedding. And I love the way that I was able to display it there. Um, if you looked at my hall, you see a big mirror. And then these paintings, not paintings, these pictures here are actually just of family members that passed away. So that's my great grandmother on the top. Uh, that's my husband's grandmother, his great grandma. This is uh, my uncle. This is my husband's uncle. This is my aunt. And this is my granddad. And I forgot, since we're all up in the foyer, I might as well show you. That's the clock that was behind me and then next to it, because you've probably seen it in the mirror. These are wedding photos of us above this little fixture we have here. It's a lamp, but it has like little shelves in there, my husband's statues. So I wasn't actually really planning on doing the little mini hallway tour but hopefully you liked it and i will see you tomorrow even though i know tomorrow it will more than likely be positive and we'll have more fun stuff to talk about bye oh thumbs up for my little hallway tour tell me what you liked <laughs>